Music to a lot of people's ears, especially oh, yeah. as, uh, you know, we've had this blizzard. A lot of folks may be waiting to get up to the mountains, and this might be a good weekend to do it. Yes, lots of sunshine statewide, no storms. So the first time in I don't know how long uh, we have a weekend with no storm systems in our state. So some great news. Uh, we're starting off a little cool this morning. We have teens and 20s around the area. Look at Elizabeth, down to 9, 13 in Parker, 19 in Firestone, 2 below in Grand Lake. This is below normal for the middle of March, so a little chilly out there. And it's the same story statewide. We have a pocket of sub-zero weather up here in the northwest. Craig down to three below zero. It's the goose egg in Frisco, zero, seven above in Gunnison, 23 in La Junta. Uh, I should have put the drought monitor in here, but I want to tell you southwest Colorado officially out of drought. We consider it a post-drought, meaning uh, you're in the place where you could slip back in should the precipitation shut off. But for now, some really good news in our southwestern corner. Uh, wind speeds here the last few days. This map has been primarily red, uh, mostly single digits and teens out there this morning. So some great news. There's the bomb cyclone up in Canada. It's moving away, but it has showers and storms all the way to the Gulf Coast this morning. We are quiet here in Colorado. Dry skies across the state and uh, lots of sunshine on the way today. There goes the bomb cyclone and here comes a warming ridge. This will be with us from now all the way through the middle of the upcoming week. So we have a few quiet days ahead that will give us some time to recover and melt. Still an avalanche warning through 6 a.m. this morning for southwestern Colorado and the Front Range Mountains. They may extend that for one more day. So if they do, we'll let you know. 40s east and west today, 30s up high, some 50s in the southeastern part of the state. Five-day forecast. It is a nice, quiet stretch. Joe Rhea, I'm taking you all the way to Tuesday of next week. And other than some passing clouds, maybe a mountain snow shower. We have a nice stretch of weather to recover and melt ahead.